right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to go over uh, what happened last week in the Pro League and my predictions and all of that good stuff. So let's get into it. As you may know from the standings already, Noble 2-0, and Fire Nice 2-0, and Hive is 2-0, and and Elevate 2-0, and PK 2-1, and Rise 1-1, and Vanquish 1-1, and United 1-1. and Rebel 0 and 2 between Queso 0 and 2, Rated R 0 and 2, and Remedy 0 and 3. So basically, how the standings work: top six automatically qualifies in the winners bracket of the tournament. Then the bottom four will qualify in the losers bracket of the tournament, and then the bottom two will have to fight to keep their pro league spot. Um, honestly, I think it will be Team Queso and Remedy, uh, the teams that will <laughs> be at the bottom two. So, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. So, um, in week one, or the first day, I had um, PK beating Vanquish and Rebel beating Elevate. So, I had two wrong for that day. That's unfortunate, so obviously went four and two. And then on the next day, the only one I had wrong is I thought VQ was going to beat Noble after the first day of watching how VQ played. But Noble is just on another level, I guess. And it's that level where I guess they're not messing around. They're putting in the work, and they're just their team play is just just phenomenal after watching it but i'm not surprised with fire and ice like i said if something with fire and ice and rise where fire and ice gets that edge and wins um hive i felt like they're gonna be e united as well with a chip on their shoulder and e united asked for it they were talking crap uh the organization was talking crap so i just had a feeling that was gonna happen and I had a feeling E United would beat Rebel after, you know, the big loss here with Elevate. <laughs> so it is what it is. So in my predictions right now, I am ten and three, I'm pretty sure. Uh four right. Uh five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. I am ten and three. So I'm gonna do my predictions here again. Uh, we got VQ against Team Queso. VQ is going to take that 2-0. Then we got Fire and Ice versus Hive. This is actually like a 50-50 in my opinion. Hive didn't... Who did Hive really play? Who did F and I play? F and I played Rise and Team Queso. And then Hive played United and Remedy. You know what? I'm going to go 2-1. F and I, just because I've, you know, lost a map to Remedy, and no offense to the homies, but they're probably a bottom two team, so I'm going to go with F and I on this one, hopefully I'm right, uh, then we got Elevate versus Fire and Ice, and this is my case from last, last time with Pittsburgh Knights getting that warm-up game, going to the next series, I'm going to do the same thing here, F and I is going to win 2-0, when they're all warmed up and ready to play the next match since they're playing back-to-back. -back. I think those back-to-backs are, are very favorable for those teams. Um, Rated R um, will play Team Quest. So I think Rated R is going to take this one. But who knows? It's just like that little, you know, Team Quest so gets that warm-up before their next match as well. So... I don't know. I'm actually going to go with Team Queso on that. I'm going to go with my theory of if you get warmed up, you should win the game. So I'm going to go with Team Queso going 2-1 on this one. Then you got PK versus Noble. I'm going to go with Noble just because they've been playing out of their mind. They've been playing great Gears of War. <coughs> and they beat Vanquish. And Vanquish beat PK. So it just makes total sense. Uh, we got Remedy versus E United. I think E United is gonna take this one, you know, two one or two oh. Then you got Rise versus Rebel. I think Rise will take this one. Rebel is just it's just unfortunate. Uh they played 
they played a match where they should have won, and that's just going to spiral down, and I think they're going to be near the bottom of the barrel, but it is what it is. Uh, but that's my predictions for that. Um, what was it? Oh, my bad. Uh, for the next day, we got Fire and Ice versus Noble. I think Noble will take this one. Um, and beat Fire and Ice 2-1. It'll be a close series. Uh, Elevate versus Rise. I think Rise will take this one. They're just more experienced uh, all around. Uh, you got Hive then versus Rise. I think Rise will take this one. Like I said before, these back-to-back -back games, you get warmed up and you're ready. So I think Rise will take that. Then you got Rebel versus Rated R. I think R Rebel will take this one. Finally get a dub on the board. Um, then, you know, like I said, the back-to-back -back thing, this will, you know, hopefully build that momentum and them beating Team Cresso. Then you got Remedy versus PK. I think PK will take that one. Then you got VQ versus E United. This is a very close one here. <laughs> Depending on what E United we get and what VQ we get, none of them are playing that day. So, depending on who they would scrim against. Probably none of the pro league teams. <sighs> Maybe they'll probably scrim against Revel or something. Early on, I don't know. <sighs> it is what it is. They're both very talented teams. I think this is just a 50-50. Uh, I'm going to go with E United with the more experience. Even though Vanquish is your, you know, your reigning champs, you and I got that experience. Yeah, I'm going to go with that. So, VQ against Queso. I got VQ winning that. F and I winning both of these series. Uh, I got Team Queso winning this one just because they got warmed up playing against the top team. Then you got Noble versus Pittsburgh Knights. I got Noble there. United vs. Remedy. I got United playing Remedy, winning against Remedy. You got Rise vs. Rebel. I have Rise winning that. And then the next day we got Fire and Ice and Noble. I have Noble winning that. You got Elevate vs. Rise. I got uh, Rise winning that. And then them winning against Hive because the back to back theory that I've been talking about. Rebel will then play against Rated R. They'll win that game. And then the back-to-back -back thing, like I said before, they'll beat Team Queso. Pittsburgh Knights will beat Remedy. And I'm actually going to take this one back. I think VQ will win 2-1. Yeah, VQ will win 2-1. So that's my predictions. That's the recap of everything. Um, obviously, I think Noble will stay undefeated. Elevate will take an L. Hive will take an L. And Fire and Ice will take an L because they're going to be playing against Noble. So I think the remaining undefeated team will be Noble. But I'm pretty sure the team that they will lose to, and I don't know why they do, will be Rise. But that it is it. That's my recap of the Pro League from Week 1 and my predictions for Week 2. Hope you guys.